Hi, this is Mike with Survive Today, just showing you how to get some water out of a river to drink. Uh, first, I got this pretty horrible water here, uh, directly out of the river. It's not very clean or clear, it's very yellowish. But then what I did is I just threw a sock over it, and uh, I don't know if you can see here, but the sock has been discolored. So what I did is I just poured it from this sock into this receptacle here, just for a little basic filtration. And if you can see, this water is very clear, there's no floaties. Uh, and why that's important is because your second step, which is going to be your, your, bottle, your water bottle filter or your Berkey filter, or uh, I, have, I keep a, uh, a Berkey water filter in my trunk at all times with my survival kit. Before I put gross water like this into my water bottle filter, and all these floaties will clog up the filter element sooner uh, and shorten its life, I'm going to pre-filter it like this, so what I'm really filtering is a lot cleaner. That will ensure better drinking water and longer service life out of my, whether it's my big Berkey or whether it's my uh, water bottle filter that I keep in the trunk. The other thing you can do if you don't want to sacrifice any of your socks is you can just, in your survival kit, throw a couple of uh, water uh, coffee filters. And you can do the same thing with a coffee filter. Just put the coffee filter over. It's a little bit slower going through it, so what you might want to do then is tie a rubber band about around it. But basically the same thing. Oh, yeah, if you have a rubber band, that's a lot better. And you're going to get a lot cleaner water out of there, uh, a first filter or a pre-filter. Uh, that's it for today. Hope you comment and like the video. And visit us at survivetoday.com.